Yo, what's going on everybody and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'll be covering the best and safest ways to cash out your CS2 skins for real money. As you are probably aware, you're unable to cash out your Steam balance for real money. Although this is unfortunate, you do have a ton of reputable sites where you can do this. Before we get any further, let's talk about the giveaways I'm doing. At 5,000 subscribers, we're going to be giving away this Brightwater Shadow Daggers. At 7,500 subscribers, I'm going to be giving away this Survival Knife Stained. And at 10,000 subscribers, I'm going to be giving away this Huntsman Knife Freehand. All you got to do, like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure your trade link or Steam ID is in the description of your YouTube channel. Now, let's continue on. So first, let's talk about the three different types of cashing out skins that you can do. The first one is on sites like Skinport. With these sites, you need to transfer your skins to the website in order to sell them, put them on sale for a set price, and pay the fee once it's bought. Once someone purchases your item, the money will be sent directly to your bank after a few days. The second option you have is player-to-player -player websites such as GamerPay, Buff Market, and CS Float. With these websites, you can list your skin on all three sites at the same time and keep the skin in your inventory until the item is purchased. Once it is purchased by someone else, you'll send the item directly to them instead of through the website. This will cancel any trade holes that would be on the website. Once the person has received the item and proof is shown, the website will allow you to receive your money. This is a great option as it is very low seller fees and buyer fees and you can list it on all three websites at the same time and still use your skin in game while you're waiting for someone to purchase it. Unlike Skinport where you need to deposit your skin onto the site and it sits there until it is purchased and you're unable to still use the item. The third and final option you have, however this is in my opinion the most risky out of the three options is to sell to traders that are buying skins. As you can see here, there are tons of people on Steam that are buying skins. Obviously, they're not going to pay the full price of what the skin is worth, probably about 30% cheaper than what it is actually worth, as they will also be reselling it. This isn't recommended unless you find someone that is very trusted and you verify with them multiple times by talking to them that you're actually speaking to the legit person. However, I would stick with options one or two. Now that we've covered the three options of how you can sell your skins for real money, let's talk about how you're going to sell and the price you're going to set them for. You're going to want to research through websites like Buff163 or Empire to see the current market value for your skins. These are changing all the time, so you want to verify a good starting price. The float will be a factor for your skins, the lower the float in the wear you have, the more you should be able to get. However, it only makes a difference if the float is extremely low for that wear. If you're looking at something minimal wear, you will get a bit more money if you're very close to that factory new float. So definitely consider your float when selling your items. Once you have figured out a good selling price, list your items on the websites you choose and wait for someone to purchase. If you don't get any purchases within a few days, you can relook at the prices and lower your price if needed. Skins on third party sites will always sell for less than what the Steam price is, as people are wanting to sell their items for real money. This is also a great opportunity if you're looking to buy items instead of sell. You can purchase them at a discount on any of these websites that I previously mentioned. I hope you guys found this video helpful. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.